I have been telling all of you that Africa is the future and anytime I say that Africa is the future I mean young Africans are the future of Africa whether you like it or not Africa belongs to us and it's time for us to think beyond the box the last time I did a video telling you guys that when you graduate from school or when you start going to school don't think of coming out and start working for people I'm not against people who work for people but i'm against the mindset that we need to go to school go look for a job buy a land build your house get married have kids and you've made it to life but start something create jobs for yourselves i mean when you create jobs it gives others opportunity to you know so that is how it is and uh, i'm so happy that i'm here as you can see i'm here to enjoy <laughs> made in ghana tea hey made in ghana look let me show you the logo if you don't believe uh, this is primo made in ghana made in kumasi ashanti region the land of otunfo i am here but i don't know where, where is the guy i mean he he feels like i feel like he doesn't want to talk to me but hey uh my brother Primo. Hello, hello. hello your hello, name hello. is Primo or what? Is, is Primo a brand or that's a real name? So, no, uh, Primo is a brand. A brand? A brand? Name. Yeah, exactly. Oh, okay. The, the brand name. The name was actually coined from two of the, the plants the plant that we use for the tea. For the tea? Uh, Frekese and Moringa. So, Primo is Frekese and then Moringa. Oh, that's oh one of the, wow. Yeah, exactly. You know, Primo, Frekese yeah. Moringa yeah. combined together. Yeah. Like, I'm impressed. Thank like you. I, I, I'm really impressed. I mean, like, there's so many people out there who doesn't know you. Okay. Can you tell us a little bit about yourself before we continue? Okay, so I'm Samuel. Samuel Ansi Jr. Ansi A-N-S-I. A-N-S-I. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I finished KNUST. Um, as a young graduate, I was just thinking about how do I uh, make an impact, create a path for myself that is very important. Okay. And Okay, no, hold okay. on. Before I let you continue, okay. you graduated from KNUST. Exactly. You never thought of like, yo, I just graduated from KNUST. I need to start um, writing my CV and start searching for a job or anything like that. Well, I, I think uh, it never occurred to me to write a CV and apply for a job because I think the, the environment in which I was also really helped. My my parents never encouraged that. Thank you. Exactly. And then my lecturer, who I was a teaching assistant to, really. Uh, like young man, you are really talented. You have so much in you. In fact, any idea you want to do, pursue it. So I think our environment really counts if we want to encourage our uh, colleagues to become entrepreneurs. It's, it's exactly, exactly. Exactly. Because I, I believe that Africa need entrepreneurs. A we want to encourage entrepreneurship because if we have so many entrepreneurship in the system, exactly. I mean, Africa would be the best place to be. Definitely. I mean, primo, Prekese and moringa. Exactly. My brother, Hello. you see, I, I'm really enjoying my primo tea, okay. and I just want to know what really inspired you to start this. Okay, so uh, growing up, my maternal grandma, mm -hmm. that's my mother's mother, but they they normally like us to pay us visits to them. They want to see their grandchildren. Little did I know that I'll be picking certain things from her. You know, she picked bread. And if I used to sleep in the where they they bake the bread, you know, and then night in the morning. She comes and then the, some of the bread is missing and all that. But the main thing I picked for her was the fact that I used to follow older cousins. She would send us to go and plant, plant, uh, plant these herbs. And then that was what we bought as tea at home. We never, in fact, never, I've never had some of these big brands that we know today. The, I didn't hear of those things when I was my grandma. What I knew was what she sent us to pluck and what we bought at home and used to eat, take the bread she baked with. Can I say your grandma is the backbone behind whatever you're doing right now? You, yeah, that is true. Yeah, you, you are very, you are very right. Yeah. See, yeah, you, you yeah, guys should right. take care of your grandma. So <laughs> make sure don't just go and steal bread like him. Go and <laughs> do something positive. You know. <laughs> All right. Okay. Good. That, yeah. was, that was good. Can you tell us some of the benefits of this um, herbs that you've been using? Okay. So, um, as I said, uh, the herbs it helps with your blood circulation. It helps regulate your blood sugar levels. It also helps uh, boost your immune system. If I eat detoxins, your system. So many of the things that we eat, that are not really, in fact, they, they don't help us, you know, 
one of the things one of the scenarios i use for people is that uh, when our mothers prepare palmnus soup i'm sure you are familiar with palmnus soup yeah of course now after preparing the palmnus soup why is that they don't use cold water to clean the bush the bowls and all that because they, when they use cold water it's they think cloths yeah. you know the oil cloths Cloth, yeah. and then the whole thing is becomes sort of kind of messy yeah so you have to use now, hot water you have to use hot water yeah. so i always say what makes you think your system is different that you you, you don't take th something like this to help clear your system and help your system work. so i'm not against any other thing or food and by the end of the know that if you cultivate the habit of taking primacy you are doing a good a whole lot for your system yeah. and one of the things i also want to talk about is we have had someone very healthy then we say oh, the person went to sleep the next day the person is dead we don't know in fact hypertension is a silent killer in africa in fact it i took part in a project where we did and so many people were so much they are they have been affected so much they didn't know that they were hypertensive now that's what happens and people just die but in at Primo here, one of the things we do believe is that you can do a lot for your health over a long period of time. People underestimate what they can do for their health over a long period of time and overestimate in a day. What do I mean? If they are sick, they will take all the drugs and everything, wanting to be well. But you can actually prevent that if you just take one cup a day. Exactly. You take one in the morning. In fact, I take twice a day. One is early in the morning, and then the last thing before I, I go to bed, you know. And I don't want to only say that, but you need to try it and get a testimony for yourself, for yourself. you know. So as you sleep, you wake up in the morning, you feel refreshed. In fact, people who cannot even sleep well have testified that it has helped them to, it suits them properly, they're able to have sound sleeps and all that. These are things that you can help us. And everyone needs sound sleep every day, not only one time. But you know, it's all the time. That means all the time, you know. So wow. that is what. I, when I came in here, I've seen that you're not working alone. Okay. Like um, I've seen young guys working in here. E you. Exactly. Like, is it like a team or? Something? Yeah. So these are my team members that I work. In fact, I, the way I met them is very wonderful. In fact, Yuma, for instance, uh, I, he used to do my milling for me, and then something happened. The dad lost the whole uh, workplace, and he had to go to be now. I said. I, you know how in fact he knows how i want my things done how the milling the the grammy sizes and everything. he knows it so well i don't talk much and i said young man why not join me instead of just being sad about your dad losing his place and it made sense to him. he said look i'm on board and i want us to see how far this it's can go. go you know uh, and i believe that um togetherness you guys will go far because exactly. I, I don't know why i've never heard of this tea until oh. i came to kumasi wow. so i feel like you guys need to promote it because i've used it and i can testify that it's really good because i've used it the last time you gave me exactly. the package and i was like oh, where where is the company i need to come in there where is the factory okay. i need to go in there and check it out primo hello hello i, I just want to say that you and your team are doing an amazing job thank you but before much. i let you guys go okay. can you just send a message to young africans out there okay i mean like those of them who yeah. are still in school and when they graduate they yeah. want to start something for themselves yeah. do you have any message for them okay so i uh, what i want to say is that in fact now social media is leveling the playing field you know the big multinationals are, are not so secure now as you may be thinking so don't be threatened by how big a brand is you'll be amazed some of the products we've sent outside and other the people we met them only through our social media um platform where we just uh, talked about what we do primoti you know and then people, okay, someone calling from nigeria say okay can you send me some someone from uh, kenya say, okay something from ghana you know kenya is very good for they are known for tea, tea yeah. you know so okay so if ghana has something then let me see what ghana to has to offer for the market and you have uganda so all these people have contacted us through social media so what you're trying to say is that you can't start a brand, use your social media to promote whatever you Exactly. Want. Let me let me know, do you actually ship, apart from people buying from Ghana, exactly. do you um, export some of them to various countries in the world? We export. In fact, you are the first, I would say, we have brought here. Because we don't actually show people where we actually go. People have, this is the first time that we are, we are actually exposing our uh, 
a few couple of times but the point is that it's not really about the space but what we are able to produce and deliver to irrespective of where you are you can we can deliver to you okay yeah and then people are just amazed that like this small business that are coming up are all of a sudden out there and then giving delivering to whatever people may add a uh, order from us yeah so, so we, we yeah. Deliver to everybody yeah so that's what i'm saying that yeah. we need to support our own we need to support this brother yeah. uh personally i'm gonna order a box okay and go give it to my mom okay and um, i just okay. want you to do the same I, I mean he did not pay me to come in here but exactly. like i said did you pay me no i can't pay you i can't pay you no so i just I want I, I just want you i just want you all to know that this is something <laughs> that we can do yeah. to support ourselves that is true that i mean true. call him today yeah buy one box I mean, he'll be so happy to exactly. see businesses running. The exactly. money stays in Africa. Exactly. This exactly. is what we are waiting for. And exactly. um, I know and believe that it will surely happen. Primo. Yeah. I mean, I want to say keep up the good work. In fact, you are also doing so much. And I'm, I'm really impressed because uh, how many people are there who understand promoting your own people? Exactly. You know, and I think you are doing really well. And Thank I'm, you I'm, so much, I'm man. Impressed. Thank I'm really you. Impressed. I appreciate it. Yeah. And uh, from today, count yourself as one of the richest guy on earth Thank because you. I, I know i have millionaires out there who are watching this video oh, and after you. this video if you don't buy i'm gonna unsubscribe you from the channel <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for watching i'm gonna see you guys tomorrow i am maya peace out <laughs>